Oh. Dr. Green. Yeah. Dr. Green swag table. They call that swag all up. Um, branded merchandise. <laughs> yeah, I like that one. Good morning. Oh, I can get the tarantula one. <laughs> I like that one too. Neat. I'm going to say go in the other direction, but I don't think it matters. Oh, there's a lizard and tarantula cup. Oh, this is all. So it can't be. Is that a, just a common gray squirrel? The, yep. Neat. She does get flyers in though. Yeah. Not very often. Oh, I didn't. Wow. I didn't know that. I'm sorry. They will be, they're being released back into the Hey, Ruth. We just, we just released. Oh, I saved that. Uh, oh, look at that. Look at that. Box. They just, they just went right out into the wild. They just left where they were. It was awesome. She was such a wild. Yeah, isn't that something? Look at how small that is. This one was caught by a cat. These two both came in on death's door. Um, that one ended up having internal injuries. Oh boy. So they got preserved so they can just record it. They can come to the I have a question. Do you, how do you get the funds to do things like this? You work for dono donations, basically. There isn't some way that you get money from the state or anything if they bring animals to you or anything else. The state doesn't fund us at all. The government, the, uh, like when we apply for our permits and stuff, through the state, we don't get funded from the state, we don't get anything from the, the yep. government or anything. Um, everything is either through donations, we do fundraising stuff, it's all out of our own pocket unless we're getting dirty. Great. Excellent. Thank you. No problem. Where are you out of? Winthrop. Pretty local. There's our plant that we have in the house, I think. Thank you. Yeah, absolutely. Which one? Jason. Pleasure. <laughs> you got a lot sold already, huh? Yeah. Wow. That's good. I guess it's kind of new. 
the red one, this brand new. I'm just going to mark a few things slow. Okay. Pork. Oh, those are those. That's that, not the coconut. I thought it was something else. <laughs> you can have that, though. It's okay, it's not broken. It, it's fine. She's doing great. That's neat. <laughs> you got your hands full. A new necklace? <laughs> Scar? Scar. Yeah. <laughs> what kind of snake is that? Um, uh, the mystic. Um, yeah. <laughs> How much is this? Fifteen. They know. They're fifteen or for this size. Oh. Is that the? Look at this one. Fifteen. That's not what he needs. Okay. It's like every like six months I see him grow like I I got one more. Uh, we'll probably use that. Yeah. Uh, it should be. Should be if you want to see one of them out, just let yeah, me know. Which one. Take a look. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Carpets are really cool. They're really cool to see. Where are you people located for your... We're in South Portland, Maine. Oh, South Portland. Yep. Yeah. We're in Gorham. Okay, yeah, let me have one of your cards. Oh, okay. This is us? Thank you. Excellent. I'm, I'm just going to walk down the end of this and come back. Shadow box is interesting, huh? Is that popcorn? They're all gone. Most of oh no, there's some in there still. <laughs> These guys are hiding. Oh, there's one that's out. It says cores. Compressed coconut core. Looks like the fabric, but I don't know if that's still the right thing for you. There, yeah, there. So that's 15. That's the that's the stuff. It looks like, but I'm not sure. Only you really know.
Oh, a bat, and he's hanging upside down even. Excellent. Did you do that? Wow. That must have taken you a bit. How do you get the bone so clean? You don't do the, the, the uh, flesh-eating beetles, do you? Those ones, yeah. Yeah. We're going to. We're going to. one, I get from a supplier that does the cleaning. Oh, okay, yes. Okay. I don't do that yet. I've okay. only done like the whole process or something. I've only done a fox. So I'm still learning. I suppose the problem with them... Did you put the... it together though? Like pieces. <laughs> okay. <laughs> like the whole thing was together. Like I didn't do... Like all the ribs were the upper cage. Like I did not do it. Yeah, I would go insane. <laughs> so it came in big pieces. That's neat. One day I will do the entire thing. <laughs> It's a lot to learn. Yeah, especially with pieces that tiny. Again, that's why the fox I did on my own. He was, he was <laughs> Are you in, located in Maine or? What? Uh, no, we're in Massachusetts. Massachusetts? Neat. Yeah, that's something else. Is that the house cat? No, Bob finally made it, eh? Bob? Yes, hi. How are you? Good, how about you? Oh, what is this, a breeding pair? Is that the idea of it? Pardon? Is this a breeding pair? Yes, yeah. about three of them. Oh, wow. The trio. The other ones that produce those two little ones, they're the ones that got left over. Wow. Neat. Excellent. Yeah, that one was the one that was the They got one open over here, Ruth. Right? <laughs> Isn't that pretty? Pocket scales, five bucks only. <coughs> Foggers and misters. Oh, here's the uh, hydrometers.
Found them. I don't know what, what you want to get. Oh, the hog nose. How about you? Wonderful. A lot of impressive equipment. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, there it is right there. I didn't see it. For Elizabeth. <laughs>
Good, how about you? Good. That's neat. What what type of snake is that? It's a golden chicken. It's a common boa. Wow. That's neat. Now how often? Do you feed it like once every two weeks or a once month? Or every two weeks. Yeah. Every two weeks. Yeah, this one's taking probably two to three rats. This one, one to two. Oh wow! And do they have the live or can they be? I know they're getting pre killed. The yep. pre killed frozen. Okay. Um, I've got a few at home that can only take the live, but most of mine are on the the pre killed. That's good. So Neat. you'll have much friendlier snakes if you can feed them pre killed. I I can understand that. They're not used to, uh, you know. They don't have to fight for their food. Yeah. And you don't have to worry about the food biting them and all that stuff. So. Oh yeah, yeah, that could be. Yeah. No, these guys. Unless you taste really, really good, these guys don't. You hear what he said about having a snake with pre-killed food? The snake is more docile. It's not. It doesn't have to really hunt for its food or fight it. We got plenty of babies available if you want to take one home. them as pets or do you have to have a special license to do that? You're, 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 you're supposed to, you're supposed to, he fall, oh, he actually falls under my brother's permit. Ah, okay. Yeah, so there is a, where it's something that can live in the wild here, it's a permitted thing, yeah. Well, like these guys here, yeah. they're illegal yeah. in the state of Maine, iguanas are illegal in the state of Maine, uh, they, they made them illegal about 20 years ago. Oh, wow. You, you can apply for the permits, but I can almost guarantee you're not going to get it. Yeah, you probably have to be connected with an educational. Probably have to only get them for education or rehab or type thing. The permit my brother has to carry is the exact same permit like New Animal Farm, York Kingdom. Yep. yep. It's, just, it's the same permit. No, I understand. When he applies for the permit, he actually has to have a list of everything he's got. Yep. Well, that makes sense. Yep. Eventually, they'll make you chip them. I think that's coming down there. Yeah, it, it well, was some things. They're about chipping us. Yeah. So, oh. Like these guys here are now the. These are the three legal species of tarantulas you can own. Okay. And what are what what distinguishes them from being legal? Just that the state has looked at these and approved them. They're not yeah. substantially different than other tarantulas out no, there. What they basically did. Is that, well, they, they, they picked 40 just to see what was going to happen. Oh, I see what you're saying, yeah. To see and how they, it goes. They wanted, they wanted to see if people were going to show up at the hospital with bites. Yep. They were going to be all in, being envenomated. And, yep. And they, they said they would re, they would re-look at the law down the road. Yep. And possibly reopen up more. Yep, yep. 
No, some of these, the females of some of these species can live really long, I guess. They can live long. They're, some of them are they're beautiful. They're beautiful spiders. Yes, there he is. What type of snake is that? Is that a... It's a uh, metlock python, a water python. Oh, okay. Neat. If you, if you actually catch him out in the sunlight, he's got a beautiful iridescent rainbow sheen. Oh, sure. I can believe that. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. What's this guy? He's a metlock python. He's going to have him. Out in the sun. That's me. <laughs> they're, they're trying to give back to me. Why is Blue trying to give back to me? That's me. Stop. Escapee. Don't do it. I will, I will put the top on. Does I want to take a run? Hey, Nugget. No. What kind of, what is this? This is a savannah What? Savannah Oh, it's a monitor, okay. So that way, whenever she's when they come by and smell, they'll feel the spike Oh, look at the size of that. But that can give you a nasty bite. Yeah, yeah, it's really funny. Boy, we, uh, he's going at my parents' house. Yeah. We have a fish fair at our, at our yeah, house. Yeah, I watch, I watch your videos, right? Oh, my yes, my, yes. <laughs> nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. Yeah, I haven't been into a reptile show forever because of the pandemic and other things. Oh, yes. And then they started the New Hampshire one was like, they had to come within a certain hour and different things, so. Very nice, that's good, though. At least they're slowly. Yeah. Yep. So what do you do? You have a show or you have... I, I have a YouTube channel. Oh, really? That's great. And the, the biggest views were the reptile shows. And awesome. the longer they were, the more people liked them. <laughs> because I would go. try to show everything I could find. There you go. So do you have some at your house? You have a... No. I'm actually just a looker. <laughs> my, I have to choose between them and my wife. So I, I'm keeping my <laughs> wife. I've seen them. I've seen your fish videos. Have you gone to like easy aquariums and stuff? Yep. I keep freshwater in, uh, well, I used to keep freshwater and I keep saltwater fish now. Oh, neat. Neat. Yeah, I'd like to do the saltwater. Definitely. Do you get any of your fish from uh, that uh, easy aquarium? Yep, I've got my fish there before. Yep. Saltwater is great. It's not as hard as people say. No. Um, I found one of those on a trail in Portland. Really? I was walking on a trail in Portland, someone had abandoned one. And he was like, he was, you know, over, he was just about two feet long. Next time you should probably report it because they're not meant to be in the wild. Oh, no, no, someone abandoned it. So 
I, I brought it, what? Oh, you, you brought it home? Well, I brought it home and re rehomed it. Someone that wanted one, it went to them. It Ooh. looked a lot like this guy, yeah. Yeah. It was a mutation even. Yeah. They said it was like, worth like 250 or 300 dollars. Can't believe someone would just dump it somewhere. So these are the three legal species of tarantulas you can have in Maine. They approved really? as three to see how it goes, see how many people complain that they got bit or what, you know, whatever. But that's why he's got them up front here. I didn't know that. And of course this is, you know, he's a rehabber, so we can have all these things like, that's just a common snapping turtle. We, can't, we couldn't have one. And we can't have silpatas, right? No, he said those are both legal, I think. Oh, okay. Both of those you can't have? Yeah, you don't, don't, those are both like that. Yeah. Small, the small one's about five years old. She's about 35 years old. Wow. Uh -huh. they'll, they'll live forever. Yeah. I was reading where they had one that had uh, musket balls from yeah. the Civil War. Yeah, uh, alligator snapper. Yeah. Yep. I was down to uh, that Zoo Nature place in Plains Plasto. I'm, I'm forgetting the name of it now, but they, they had a day where people were bringing in their reptiles to show and someone had a huge alligator snapping turtle. It yeah. was enormous. We, I'm not sure if we still have it or not. We, we had one down the center. A little tiny thing. Yep. Hey. They get big. Red-eared sliders are strictly prohibited. You cannot own them. Yeah. Yeah. As long as it, it, it's a native turtle. Yeah. So you're so all you native. These guys are native turtles. Yep. These guys are native turtles. I'm confused. Good, how about you? Very good, thing. Keeping out of trouble? Absolutely not. 
<laughs> That's good.